Okay, so in today's video, I'll be just showing you a, a little bit of the progress I have on my aquaponics system. It's still on its way, but I'll be showing you what I have right now. So at the moment, I have my 300 gallon fish tank here. I still, I need to make more holes at the bottom of the solids lifting overflow. Because as you can see, the water is going at the top, so the flow isn't good enough at the bottom. But I have this running, my pump, my external pump is going through here, through this inch and a half pipe. Um, then I had to put a an overflow here just in case so as you can see it's going out here just wanted to have it run I still need to circulate it after that but I'm just letting it run just to make sure it all works then I have my two filters here um, this is a swirl filter I'll show you how to make both of these on a later video it's kind of hard to see it's already collecting some dirt down there and then from the swirl filter it goes to this mechanical filter that I have here. When I get more of the the mesh in there, I'll put some more in there. But that's a mechanical filter. And then from these two filters, it goes into these three beds. These two will I'll, I still need to fill with hydroton. Um, they they have bell siphons on them. This one it was going to be a floating raft system, but since I have other ones that can be used as floating rafts. You can see the big blue one. I'm gonna use this grow bed to grow duckweed so I can have some food for the fish and also because duckweed is also good for uh, filtration. So I'll have that in here. I still need to put a little little bucket around this one so the duckweed doesn't go down there. And then I'll also put a venturi on here. I can show you how do I make that so that they have air bubbles. And then these these two beds are connected. They'll be connected to this one over here later on. I just need to get a liner for it. And they all go down into here. I have a video on how I set this up that I will post later. Um, but basically, this is a three inch pipe going from three different grow beds and then down, down along here. This works if anyone ever was wondering if they can lay a pipe along the ground. Um, it works because, you know, the water fills up here and then the pressure just pushes it out. So then I have down here my sump tank. And then my ex external pump. And then yeah, from there it goes along there to there. So right now I'm trying, I need a, the moment I'm gonna shim these up so that they're ready and see if they can hold water. Make sure if I need to seal any leaks, then all I need to do is twist this and turn it on and then this one goes from here into that grow bit over there. So this one right here will be a floating raft. That one I'll fill with hydroton when I find enough later on on Craigslist. Then from there it goes down into my sump tank. So as you can see, this is what I have up running so far. Um, it's getting there eventually. So yeah, in that video, I just showed you my progress on my aquaponic system. It's getting there slowly. Um, so if you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. And don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe.